All right, here we are, gonna make crepes. The batter's simple, it's a cup of flour, a cup of milk, and one egg, blended with a stick blender or whisk very low. Should look something like this. Nice and thin so it will run into the pan. Take your pan, you want a black steel pan if you have one, clarified butter. Right in the pan, it should be good and hot. For this 10 inch pan, we use a two ounce ladle of batter right in. Swirl the batter around to get it to stretch to the size of your pan. Back on the fire. You gotta make two if you got a lot of hungry mouths to feed. As it finishes cooking, take a spatula, make sure it's loose all the way around, right under it, flip it over, beautiful crepe. That's it, it should be nice and loose, lightly toasted on the other side. The batter so, so uh, the crepe so thin it cooks very quickly. We're ready to go. There we go. Done. We have our apple filling here. It's just sauteed apples like you would for a pie with some butter, cinnamon, and sugar. Warm it up a little bit. Right into the middle of the crepe with a little bit of the juice, not too much, so it doesn't run out. Then we roll the crepe, just like a little taco or burrito. Put it on this, and we're gonna bake these off for our order. We got three hungry people in the dining room.